Hello everyone, I'm Diego Escobar. And I'm Carter Hale. Welcome to Springdale Today. Today is a special day at Springdale District Television. We just returned from the Spring Creek Festival. The Spring Creek Festival is the largest multimedia festival in the Midwest, showcasing nearly 1,000 students competing in broadcast journalism, film, production, photography, and more. Springdale District Television attended and we are very proud to represent the Springdale schools. In today's show, we will showcase the videos from the Spring Creek Festival. Springdale Today starts right now. One of the most prestigious awards at Spring Creek Festival is Festival Recap. Teams have one day to shoot as much of the festival as they can and produce a two-minute video over the festival. Springdale District Television won first place for our Festival Recap video. Here is what it's like to be at the largest multimedia festival in the Midwest. This was produced by Diego Escobar and Robert Wilson. Everyone has a story. Everyone has a journey they have faced. Things in life that have brought them to who they are today. But we are all here, together as one, at Spring Creek Festival. We all share the same drive and passion for media. We are here to gather experience and gain from our peers. We're so proud to be here at the Jones Center today to celebrate you all. We are not the ones to sit back and watch as a moment in time passes by. We are the ones to capture moments in history and people will look back at and gain inspiration. We are the broadcast journalists, cinematographers, photographers, and together, we are the next wave of young artists that can turn this whole world around. Spring Creek Festival, where we take our thoughts into stories and explore our imagination to create a film. We are here to build relationships, make long-lasting memories, and lead the change as one. We are all dreamers. This is more than a festival. This is an outlet for us to make change. And it all starts here. What makes me unique? The moments I capture, that's what makes me unique. The friendships I've made makes me unique. The memories I've made makes me unique. Spring Creek Festival makes me unique. Spring Creek Festival makes me unique. There were nearly 1,000 total attendees at the festival, from colleges to vendors and industry leaders. Students had the opportunity to directly impact their future. One of the premier sponsors of the Spring Creek Festival is the Bitten Bell Film Festival. This year, they sponsored a competition called Kickstart Inclusion. Here is the first place winning video. Everyone has a story. A story to be told, a story to be shown, stories that have brought us from our lowest points in our lives to who we are today. With our different backgrounds, stories, and cultures. We are one community brought together by love. United as one, we are the generation that can make the change. Include those who don't have a home. Spread love and happiness, and never doubt yourself. Diego, congratulations on winning first place. Talk a little bit about what inspired you to make this video. 
So Cape Start Inclusion is pretty much about, you know, a diversity in our community, which is Springdale. And so my idea for this video was to gather a bunch of my friends and from different cultures and different backgrounds and come to the studio one day after school and uh, produce this video. And, you know, the super cool thing is that we all may look different and have different stories, but there's always something that ties us back together. And that was what kickstarted inclusion in my video. That is excellent. Congratulations, Diego. Thank you. Diego was not the only team to be recognized for their BFF inclusion video. Robert Wilson and McCain Woods were awarded third place for their feature of the Parson Hills Walk Home program. Parson Hills is a very diverse community. We have um, about 10% of our students are Caucasian. We have about 54% um, Hispanic, 32% Pacific Islanders. But here at Parson Hills, we're just one big Panther family. And that sense of community is built through um, all of the relationships that we build. We just have that family feeling when our students are walking home every day after school. We have teachers on duty, but we often also have lots of teachers who just volunteer their time. It's a good relationship building time to talk to kids as they're going home. Um, many of our teachers, like I said, do extra duty every week just to one, make sure those kids are safe, but two, um, like I said, to build those relationships. Walking home together does create an environment when they get to school that they are friendly and they can collaborate more because they know each other from playing in the, um, in the neighborhood or walking home. We not only have older siblings helping their little brother or sister, but we often have students that are not even related, but um, an older student may see a little kindergartner or first grader a little nervous because there's a lot of kids and a little bit of space, you know, and walking the same direction and they are eager to just jump in, help each other out, um, you know, and I think that just builds the community relationship here in the building at school, but it often carries to the home environment. Carson Hills is known as a walking school, which means nearly every student walks to and from school. The Spring Creek Festival partnered with the Downtown Springdale Alliance to create a 30-second commercial competition showcasing farmers markets in Northwest Arkansas. Springdale District Television's Robert Wilson won first place. The Northwest Arkansas Farmer Market Alliance, fresh produce locally grown, as well as decor, crafts, and flowers, with live entertainment and a side of prepared food and beverages for you to enjoy every moment, every Saturday from 7 a.m. to 1 p.m., so you can get to know your farmers, come support your community with only a taste of the Ozarks. For more information, visit nwafarmersmarkets.org. Springdale District Television also won second place in Farmers Market com Commercial Competition. Here is the commercial. Welcome to the Northwest Arkansas Farmers Markets, your local one-stop shop to get everything you need from fresh produce to homemade knickknacks and more. Come taste the Ozarks, live music, crafts by local artisans, and fresh sweet treats. Every Saturday from 7 a.m. to 1 p.m., the Northwest Arkansas Farmers Markets, the right place to be. That video was edited by Logan Davis and shot by Diego. Diego, you and the team went out to several different farmers markets to shoot video. Talk about your experience. You know, uh, getting what we're learning here in the studio and getting the real life things that we are taking away and then going out there and applying those to real life situations like farmers markets and getting out there in the community and shooting this awesome video and getting to know so many people was an, an, an awesome experience for not only me but for the whole team. You know, we all grew together, we're all growing together and, you know, taking those small little things that we're learning and applying those is so much fun. At Spring Creek Festival, there was an on-site commercial competition. Students had five hours to, to make a commercial about the Jones Center. Here is the first place winning commercial. Welcome to the Jones Center. With an indoor swimming area, ice skating rink, track and basketball court, the Jones Center is the place to be. Lying in the heart of Springdale, Arkansas, the Jones Center hosts hockey games, swim meets, and much more. 
The Jones Center was made to reflect the vision of Harvey and Bernice Jones. It is the one center to learn, play, and belong. Logan Davis and Carter Hale were the first place winning team. Carter, what was it like to only have five hours to produce this commercial? Well, it was such a high energy environment. It was so fun and intense. Uh, it's all about pacing though. If you stay focused and aim small, miss small, you'll reach your goal. That's right. Coming up after the break, we showcase some music videos produced by our own Springdale District Television students. The Springdale Fire Department exists to enhance the quality of life in Springdale by minimizing the devastating effects of fire, medical emergencies, and natural and artificial disasters. Do you value commitment? Honor? Integrity? Loyalty? Respect? Service? Then you should join the Springdale Fire Department. TK Martial Arts, where we are dedicated towards the advancement of martial arts in Northwest Arkansas. Learning MMA, Judo, Jiu Jitsu, team development, and cross discipline affiliation. Join to develop respect, honesty, perseverance, self control, and humility. You can join by coming to any of our classes Monday through Saturday at 207 Commercial Avenue in Lowell, Arkansas. Contact us at 479 365 0783 and make sure to check out our Facebook page. Bulldog fans, stay connected with your favorite team all year long with the official app of the Springdale Bulldogs. A free download in the App Store and Google Play, the Springdale Bulldogs athletic app will keep you up to date with all things Red Dog. Schedule, scores, rosters, news, social media, final score notifications, as well as live broadcasts are just a touch away. The official app of the Springdale Bulldogs, proudly presented by Crane Buick GMC. Download today for free in the App Store and Google Play. Springdale District Television has some very talented teams. Ivan Lyros produced a music video for the Spring Creek Festival called Peace, Love, and Positivity. Let's check it out. Every day is seeming harder, why even bother? I hustle hard for my mother, family, and father Only if you understood the struggle that I'm going through Put yourself in my shoes, wouldn't know what to do I've been struggling all my life, doesn't matter if you're black or white We're all the same, it doesn't matter the race Because at the end of the day What are you doing to make this world a better place? It don't matter my race, it don't matter if you're bi, gay, or straight Don't make no mistake, I was born in the United States So this is where I'm gonna stay Change unless you got none. Asking the Lord up above, or whoever your praise, whatever your race, whatever your case, whatever your face, it don't matter because we're the same. We all want to numb the pain with the money. It rules the world, you can see it on the surface. When I do this, I want to do it with a purpose because of my life, I've been hurting. So look at me, what you see, just a guy who wants to spread peace, love, and positivity. All I'm saying, man, spread peace, love, and positivity. Sticking with the theme of music videos, Jacob and Maverick produced a deep music video about family. The world that we live in, in people say it's cool. One little mistake and they call you a fool Why everybody gotta judge what you do? I ain't trying to be rude, I'm just telling the truth Yeah, I'm chilling, living, I'm just patiently waiting I'm patiently waiting till I run out of time Yeah, and every day I wake up, I thank the Lord For blessing me with a mom I don't deserve at all She's always had my back, believe that I can go beyond my dreams 
She's always encouraging me, she's always been there She said, son, be your best in school And don't be a fool And always use that brain of yours as a tool, child But then everything changed when my mama left my dad When my grandpa and my sister passed away from this world I was here all alone, I was lost in the dark I was here all alone, I was lost in the dark But then every morning I would wake up thanking the Lord For giving me more time in this world, yeah It don't matter if you have a different skin, yeah It don't matter if you have a different culture, yeah That's the beauty of this world, yeah Where's the love now? God brought us here to love one another God brought us here to love each other All we have to do is pick each other up, yeah And make sure that we don't fall, yeah Coming up after the break is news around the district and what's live this week on the Springdale Schools YouTube channel. Springdale Today will be right back. If you haven't been to Everett Chevrolet, we'd like to invite you to come see us and discover what family owned, customer friendly really means. There is a difference. Everett Chevrolet, I-49 at Elm Springs Road. Wildcat fans, stay connected with your favorite team all year long with the official app of the Harbor Wildcats. A free download in the App Store and Google Play, the Harbor Wildcat Athletic App will keep you up to date with all things Wildcat. Schedules, scores, rosters, news, social media, final score notifications, as well as live broadcasts are just a touch away. The official app of the Harbor Wildcats, proudly presented by Crane Buick GMC. Download today for free in the App Store and Google Play. Fastlane Entertainment is a family-friendly establishment that provides 75,000 square feet of wow with a state-of-the-art bowling alley, with arcade games, a two-story laser tag arena, spin zone bumper cars, with 10 party and conference rooms for birthdays and group events. Fastlane has everything you need for family-friendly fun. Find us on Facebook or FastlaneBowl.com. Take a fresh look at the Jones Center, the premier place in Northwest Arkansas for year-round ice skating, swimming, basketball, working out, and ice hockey. It's a great place to celebrate business, school, and family events in one of our many spacious meeting rooms. Become an annual member or just come for the day and enjoy our first-class amenities at our state-of-the-art facility that distinguishes it from all others. Only at the Jones Center, serving Northwest Arkansas for over 20 years. It's a place to belong. Welcome back, and now it's time for News Around the District. With Springdale Today, I'm Carter Hale, and this is News Around the District. Kindergartners and fourth graders took a day outside to tend to their gardens at Parson Hills Elementary. The Hispanic Women's Organization of Arkansas awarded Springdale Public Schools with the Community Excellence Award. Superintendent Dr. Jim Rollins gladly accepted the award. Turnbow Elementary students learned about fire trucks and learned how to escape a house fire when they were visited by members of the Springdale Fire Department. Helston Middle School students learned how gas combustible engines work. They were visited by some Springdale High School students along with an instructor. Make sure to follow us on Instagram and Facebook and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Well, that's all the time we have this week. Thank you for watching Springdale Today. Make sure to follow us on Instagram and Facebook, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you next week.